My name is Cody Jimenez. I'm a narrative oil painter. I was raised in Las Cruces, New Mexico, where I got my uh, BFA from New Mexico State University. And then I came to Southern California to Laguna College of Art and Design to pursue my master's degree. And I've been here for about three years now. I didn't want to do anything typical nine to five. I didn't want to pursue like a graphic design job. I didn't want to do any of that. So I decided that I'm just going to paint stuff because I can tell stories that way. And that was the best thing for me. So I started painting more seriously. I started pursuing shows locally, trying to find ways to make as many paintings as I can and try and push them out to a bunch of people. When I got my first show, it was, I kind of had, it wasn't what I was expecting. I was expecting to show maybe like a painting or two, but then I ended up getting like a, a small room in a gallery, so I had to fill up all these walls. So I was really into like a narrative idea, telling a story throughout the paintings. I framed everything, I matted everything, and that was my first experience. Outside of like school art stuff and like school projects, it was really my own pursuit while I was in school, and I think that gave me a head start compared to other people in school. Being involved in community is really great. I mean, it's really good to have your own time while painting, kind of to seclude yourself, to get work done, but Finding that balance of being around other artists that influence you, that push you further, friends in school or just like in the same studio area, if you're into the same type of artwork, being around each other, pushing each other, helping each other achieve goals. Mm -hmm. So for me, a lot of, um, I use a lot of the Trapel brushes. Um, I first started with the Tacon brushes because they're kind of good all-around brushes. Can do a lot of starting paintings. They're soft enough. They're firm. Can do a lot of quick like lines, really great lines. A lot of blending. A lot of really soft glazes. And then I started getting other brushes. And hog bristles are great to start off paintings. For me now, I really enjoy the stiff brush of that, like kind of plotting out stuff really quickly, getting big chunks of paint on there. And then later I'll come in with like the softer brushes and do detailing and line work and blending and, and all of that stuff. So it's kind of everything for me. What I fell into was trying to make things I thought other people would like, like fan art type stuff. And that was chasing something that just wasn't going to work out. And it was really upsetting afterwards. But what I should have been doing is making stuff that I liked a lot and really putting my heart into it and finding places to show those artwork, those art pieces, drawings, paintings, whatever. Like as long as you're honest with yourself that you're doing this because you want to do it, it's, it'll connect with somebody somehow. I don't know how, but it happens. It's a weird magic thing about art.